These crack tools are for acoustic guitar repair. To level cracks that are out of flush in the top of a guitar or the side, and it can pull a crunch out of the lower waist where you could never reach. And you do that by putting a wooden cleat on the inside of the crack with glue to support it and pulling it into place with the crack clamp from the outside. The crack clamp is simply a winch. It's a block of polyurethane, which means you can clean glue off it easy, mount it with a guitar tuner, and it acts as a winch, pulling a string up through the crack, bringing a cleat into place. The cleats you make are lightweight, and you make them out of the kind of wood that you're working on. There's rosewood and maple and a spruce one. They're 5 eighths in diameter and plenty strong enough for a good glue job, but not so much as to add weight to the top and hurt the sound. And you make them with this cleat cutter tool that we designed. It makes a 5 eighths diameter plug with a sixteenth of an inch hole in the center. What I have here is a piece of 3 sixteenths acrylic for a little extra flattening effect. Got a hole drill for my music wire. Actually, I have two different cracks going here. There's one here and one there. It's not one long crack. I don't always use a secondary call like that. Sometimes I go right on the crack with the tool itself. Another part of the tool set is this little pin vise. It holds a short piece of the music wire so you can come down on a crack and poke it through the crack to get you started. Then it's easy to run the wire through it when you do the job. There's a lot of cracks and fissured cracks where there's fractures of wood that it's hard to work glue into. You can do that with the air gun. It's got a suction tip and you can blow glue in at about 10 PSI. My advice is if you're using tight bond or whatever glue you're using, water it down a bit on the first application so the water helps draw other glue after it. That's a tip I learned at the Martin Repair Shop. So this is a tool that can clamp together parts that you can't always reach. I could reach that. I probably couldn't reach that with a sound hole clamp. And you can't use a sound hole clamp on a guitar side. Imagine this. You've got to split all the way down the side and it happens. With the curve call and you can heat acrylic with a hot heat gun, you can have an exterior call that fits perfectly and run a whole line of clamps all the way down the side and pull that side together. And the last reminder is when you put a cleat on a crack, put the grain at an angle across the length of the crack, about a 45 degree angle. And when you're done, from the outside all you have is a cr repaired crack with a tiny little hole that you punch through with your pin vise. Easy to fill and hide.